Are you ready to go to bed? I hope that each and every one of you is taking your makeup off before you go to bed. Wash your face. So I'm just gonna share with you my routine. Now, normally I am a bath taker. I love soaking in the tub at the end of the day. I throw some Epsom salts in um, and just totally relax. Sometimes I even fall asleep. First of all, I gotta take off my eye makeup. And I must say that I was introduced to the Mary Kay eye makeup remover. Love it, I can't believe how well it works. So. I'm just gonna go ahead and just remove my eye makeup. In fact, I even put it in my treatment room bathroom so that when you guys come in for a facial that you take your eye makeup off because I hate spending time taking mascara off. See how much comes off? And my whole goal is to spend as much time on your face cleaning it and prepping it and hydrating it and lifting it and smoothing it then spending it on makeup so pretty good huh so i got that all off and now um i'll check back with you because i'm gonna jump into the tub so i'm in my tub right now and i just want to share with you my favorite is the brightening cleanser now i just have the travel size and I just like using the little ones just so I don't have all these big stuff hanging around here. But I'm just gonna go ahead and wash my face first in the tub and I'm getting up very warm. I'm gonna do a little bit of a different treatment today in the bathroom and that's putting an enzyme on my skin. So um, I'm just gonna give myself a little facial spa treatment at the end of the day. So I mixed me up a little bit of a Hungarian enzyme mask from Lemieux. It's a powder form and I put in some isocell toner to make it like a little frosting now. I should use a brush to apply it, but I forgot to bring it here. So I'm just gonna apply this enzyme. Now please note enzymes, I tell people, it's like a Pac-Man effect. What it does is just kind of chew up the dead skin cells. It's not an acid, so it's more gentle, but it's great for all skin types, especially for sensitive skin. I have some clients that just cannot use acid on their skin. They're just so sensitive. So this Hungarian enzyme I use, and I just mix it up in a little cup here like this. Um, and I'm just gonna spread it on and use it all up. And because I'm in the tub, I feel like I'm having a, my own little sauna. This is a jacuzzi tub, so I'm gonna put on the jets because that'll stir up some more steam on my face. So I don't do this all the time. I mean, in fact, I'm gonna be honest with you, it's about the first time I've been doing this. I just feel like I need to take care of myself a little bit here. So get it on your neck. And it doesn't sting at all. And just layering it on. Like I said, if you had a brush, it'd be much nicer to use. All right, so just don't get it in your eyes. Get a lot of it where your most congested is. Mine is the nose. And then right here on the chip. Okay. So um, after about 15 minutes, I'll just rinse it off. And I will get back with the next step. Okay, I got the jets on. I don't want to show you too much. And now I'm getting a lot of steam. Steam needs to activate the enzymes. So I just went ahead and rinsed off the mask, but oh my gosh, the clarity in my skin just looks brighter. The key thing in this uh, Hungarian enzyme, besides being thermal mud, is pearl powder. Pearl powder is known to help lighten and brighten up the skin. So with that said, 
Now I'm gonna go ahead, and I've already made my little cocktail of serums in this little cup here. I got hyaluronic, vitamin C, stem cell EGF, and TGF mixed up in there. And I'm gonna just apply it, and then I'm just gonna relax another, oh, let's say 15 minutes, but I'm gonna go ahead and then put the BioCell mask. It's the sheet mask that is uh, marine freeze-dried collagen, and it's just packed with all kinds of um, serums that's got peptides and hyaluronic and vitamin C and um, everything for firming and lifting. So I'm gonna put the serums on first, do my quick little massage, and then put my BioCell mask on. And I probably will just get out of the tub then with the mask on and just, you know, get ready, uh, watch a little TV with it on. So I applied the sheet mask on. Now it comes into three layers. I'm keeping the outside um, cellulose type layer on top because you know what? There's enough solution in the mask, in this envelope that I can use it again. So I took off this paper here. This is the thicker paper. And when I'm done, I'm just gonna put it back on there and then just put it back in this envelope that came in because there's a lot of good serum still left in there. And that's why I wanna keep this um, sheeting on so I could use it again. I got them, I'm always looking for something to get more bang for my buck, right? But, oh, this feels so good because this hot steam bath opened up all my pores, dilated it. I put the serums on. I just felt it like going right into the skin. And then I put this mask on. It was like, ooh, kind of cool. But I say, firm it up. Okay, so that's what I'll do tonight and just leave it on for about, oh, you know, the 15, 20 minutes. Remove it, put the paper back on, put it back inside the envelope, and then I'm ready for bed. I don't rinse this off, okay? So don't rinse it off and you're good to go. So any um, more treatments I'll be sharing with you, what I do in my, my room here, my bathroom, and I'll, um, so that you can even do a lot of this yourself. But this bath is wonderful, a way to just totally relax and not take a quick, you know, five, 10 minute shower, but just be able to soak in your tub and relax. Bye, and I'll see you next time. Jenny Okada, registered nurse, esthetician, and Winds of Change owner and coach, skincare coach, since 1991. So I'm gonna be going into my 30th year of business next February and just love what I do, and I love you. So I'm laying here in bed. I think I like the lighting better in the bathtub. It's darker. <laughs> anyway, uh, I just feel so refreshed, relaxed. I got my BioCell mask uh, off, put it back in the package so I could use it again. So everybody, have a good night. Sleep tight. And don't let the bed bugs bite. Bye.